In stories, watching a character change makes them more compelling. You root for the character that was once a good-for-nothing person want to become better. You want them to redeem themselves from the sins they have committed. Like John Marston from Red Dead Redemption, a seasoned outlaw after running away from his old gang to start a family, he is forced to work for the government to hunt down his old gang members, who never changed. He does this to atone for his past and to keep his family safe. Another character change that is my favorite is a fearful character turned ruthless and savage due to their environment. Usually soldiers like Paul from All Quiet on the Western Front. However, there are characters who are once good but turned evil. Innocent characters you once rooted for now become murderous, despicable, and vile characters due to circumstance or if it's their true personality all along. Characters like Walter White, a meek chemistry teacher turned drug kingpin. Arthur Fleck, a struggling comedian with mental disorders becoming the clown prince of crime. And Anakin Skywalker, a hero corrupted by hate and was manipulated to do horrible acts. But none of these drastic character changes will ever hold the candle to this one Japanese woman that does piano covers. Pan Piano is a Japanese YouTuber that does piano covers. Well, at a glance at her channel, you'd think her channel was ripped straight from a gravier site filled to the brim with computer viruses. But no, this is literally what she does. Play piano wearing the most skimpiest of outfits. And I mean, look at those massive, succulent, and tantalizing views! Millions of views per video, like Imagine an Asian kid with strict-ass parents forcing their kid to learn the piano. The kid goes on YouTube to look for piano covers and tutorials, and since Pan Piano's videos gets tons of views, imagine the kid clicking on her video. The parents see this and... My melanated brother, you are getting ze belt. Anyway, let's talk about the thumbnails and the content of her video for a bit, and go for a rant. So, thumbnails and videos like these are okay. Cleavage out, panty shots, and whatever this is, is fine. Not age restricted, no nothing. But the moment I have anime girls on the thumbnail, I swear a few times and have a few dick jokes here and there, it's age restricted? I mean, come on now. This is an actual children's book. Do you want to play with my balls? Right, so I just want to talk about her not because of YouTube injustices, but because her style and content is intriguing. And no, not that kind of intriguing. A girl in skimpy clothing doing piano covers with millions of views and subscribers isn't the intriguing part, but the fact that her face to this day is still a mystery. And no, she isn't Davy 504 And not to mention the sudden change in her clothing. Believe it or not, her early videos was her wearing normal clothes playing the piano. And that's it. I mean, what happened? It's like seeing that one quiet smart girl back in high school turn to prostitution after high school to get by or something. The answer is views. Of course it's views. If we look at the video where it all began, or the event horizon, or had an event for that matter. Come on Mr. Mason, just say it! Tell me why you treat me differently than all the other students. Because you're black! It turns out she's been playing piano in skimpy clothing for over four years now. Scrolling through her videos, I believe this is where it all began. First, look at the difference in views of this video and the five videos before this. And look at the clothes she's wearing too. And finally, look at the videos after this. See the massive views now that she's wearing skimpy clothes? Case closed. We have the serious case of the female internet celebrity black pill. What is that you ask? It's the fact that in order for female internet celebrities to get by or get massive numbers, is to show skin. Examples of this is Belle Delphine. What's up, Game of Boys? It's time to get your Game of Girl bathwater. That happened, and we all let it happen. Who was once a nobody, now has become the whore of Babylon. And another good example are obviously female Twitch streamers. Look, I get the hustle and the grind of these women. 
If I was a woman and had a smoking hot body and have lost all my dignity, I would probably do the same. Knowing the pay is leagues higher than most jobs on the planet. I'm not judging her content in a negative way at all. Do what you have to do to chase the bag, you know what I'm saying? Like, whatever she's doing and her numbers right now is way better than whatever the hell I'm making. Ooh, that's kind of small. Yikes. Meme tubers and niche commentary YouTubers don't pay the bills that much, you know. Hmm, <laughs> bratty? Even if YouTube doesn't pay her a lot, because I know damn well videos and thumbnails like these get the yellow monetization mark. She still has a Patreon to get the most bag. And God only knows what happens on that site. Of course, not all female internet celebrities are like that. But a majority. You know, it's a damn shame that women on the internet have to show skin in order to get views. As someone who has been nonchalantly reading feminist books, this is not cool type shit. Wait, yo, 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 editor. Why did you leak my ID card? Now everyone knows my height is 6'4. My likes are Lana Del Rey, Leve, Mac DeMarco, women's rights, and driving my Hellcat. Not to mention my dislikes are the patriarchy and Taylor Swift haters. That's not cool, editor. Yo, why did you leak my ID type shit? Now my viewers know my hobbies are cooking, maintaining my dreads, reading feminist books, and acting nonchalant. Nah, that's not cool type shit. I'm your editor who edits all your sloppy ass videos. Like, you don't know me like that. I know you're my editor and all, like, you don't know me like that, like, for real. By the way, the payment is on its way right now. I forgot how many I put, but I know it's a lot. Thank you, sir, I can finally feed my family of five. All hail Thotty. Total thoughty victory. I know you've been working hard, editor, but you don't have to leak my ID type shit, you know what I'm saying? My bad, King. By the way, isn't this the part where you play audio porn you found on Pornhub? Fuck you mean this is the part where I play audio porn? What does that even supposed to mean, man? Like... You gave me a file called Shy Cow Girl Wants to be Milked and Filled. ASMR audio roleplay. Don't be so weird type shit, like there's people watching, like... I don't know what that means, dog. like, for real, like... But you said to play this audio at the end of this video, sir. Like, you need to stop whatever you're doing, man, like, you don't know me like that. My fault, OG. Look, man, like, I have things to do, like, retwist my dreads type shit. You gotta finish this video before the weekend, you know what I'm saying, like, so I can pay you more. I'll go back to editing this video for you then, King. Anyway, ladies, if you think my editor is tweaking for leaking my information like that, then tell that to my Instagram through DMs, type shit, type shit. You can see where this is going. Nope. Right? <laughs> They're really, really full, and I don't have any way of doing it myself. What the scallop? So it would help a lot if you could... <laughs> milk me. Embarrassing! 